Look what I found. Oh. Hey, what up, and welcome to another episode of Crease Teeth. Now, before we go any further, let's do a bit of shopping. All right, so we head down to Sydney with the boys. We're going to go see Air. We'll see what it, everyone's got on feet. Me, I'm done for a little bit. That might be why I'm a little bit late to lunch because I'm like, I, I want to do some Jordan 1s because of the movie, but we're going to go the reimagined 3s purely out of comfort. So let's go. Hopefully, Fast Time's got them grey gum joints. Maybe we see the lucky greens. I don't know, but we'll do a bit of shopping too. So we just got here at Parramatta. Got to park pretty easy, but motherfuckers up your ass while you're trying to fucking park. I have to go like the third one because of that. It's all good. We're gonna go a quick little shop, meet up with the boys at BL Burgers. I am not early. This is the right day, so let's do it. While I was in Sydney, you know, we're meeting up with the boys and everything like that. Um, this was pre-organised for the Sneakheads Australia group to go see the movie Air. Um, did a little bit of shopping beforehand. Might have done a lot of shopping beforehand, but saw the uh, Sunrise Jordan 1, saw the uh, Jordan 11, I think they call them Cements, the Lowe's. Saw the new protection pack joints in the black. I, man, I feel like I need them, but by this point I'd already bought two pairs, so. I also saw the Pegasus. Is it the 89 Pegasus? There's a really good uh, university blue colorway on the Nike app. I, I'm just waiting to see them in hand. These ones were actually on special, and so was the white cement Jordan 1. They were down to $200, which is crazy because Jordan 1 retros don't go on sale. But let's get into it. Before we went to the movie, we went to lunch. Uh, there was a few pulled out. It just happened to be me, Julian, and Oliver. But here's a bit. Look what I found. Oh, you got two pairs. Yeah, I couldn't help myself. Wow. Oh, first times as well. What'd you get, man? Uh, the only person to not wear Jordans. Yeah, 
Is it a faux pas wearing Essex to the Jordan movie? <laughs> Beautiful. Lucky greens. And I've got to say, taxi-like vibes. The green, the green is very, okay. Uh, I can see why people are a little bit iffy because the green is not exactly green, green. A, a lot of shade of green. But, I mean, are you going to stick with the green laces or are you going to go black? Ooh, I don't know. I think I'd go black. Green might be too much. Yeah. Crazy, crazy, crazy pickups. I'm gonna go put them in the car, but get ready for the movie. So we're back, Air Movie, brilliant. It was actually a really good movie. I know everything that's gonna happen, every little detail, and I loved it. The one thing that threw me was like Peter Moore doing a kickflip in the car park. I'm like, uh, I don't know if the kickflip would have been invented then, but apparently it was, but everyone wouldn't have been doing it by then, but it's very nitpicky. We had a couple pickups too. Yeah, it, it was a cool day. Man, I, I, the one thing straight away that blew me away was like the soundtrack. The soundtrack was incredible. The other thing that I kept thinking was like, the next movie they got to do is like Kobe during his free agency. That'd be incredible. So, let's head home, open up the shoes, see what we got. Maybe we go to another store. I don't know. It's what 20 to 4. Probably ain't got time. I don't know. We'll see. Whatever you're seeing next is what you're seeing. Good to catch up with the boys. Met Josh for the first time. He had the lost and founds. Man, I need them. I need them. Uh, maybe when I'm in Melbourne, maybe I'll do a trade for him or something. I don't know. Let's go. So we get to the cinemas and another bloke, I actually can't remember your name, you were such a nice guy and I feel terrible for not remembering your name, I'm guaranteed to see you around, but yeah, we went and seen the movie man and it exceeded expectations, like honestly, I, I know Matt Damon and Ben Affleck can create movies, Good Will Hunting is one of the best movies ever, right? And I know they, you know, they, there was all this talk, you'd never see Michael Jordan and all this, and they had Nike and Jordan's Blessing, but I cannot talk high enough about this movie. Just, I knew everything that was going to happen, I knew the whole story, but it was still great. And honestly was, the soundtrack was incredible. Yeah, I, I really enjoyed this movie. There was a couple nitpicky things, like obviously it was the ship that was shown to Michael initially and then they altered it to make the Air Jordan. Plus um, Peter Moore doing kickflips in the car park. He might have been skateboarding at that point, but the kickflip had only just been invented, so I doubt he was doing that. But really good movie. Great to catch up with the boys. Thanks to Oliver for organizing it. And I was actually on time. I wasn't a day early this time, so that's always good. But there was pickups, so let's do that. All right, we've got a couple pickups while we're in Parramatta. What should we do first? Let's go with a fast time. So, purple SB dunk box. I don't know about you man, but if you're a skater like me, like I just love getting stickers and the bags though too. Let's have a look. Look, one of three colours. I've already got one, so it's one of the other two. Super clean. No hype. They keep restocking, but as a skater man, like I need them.
yeah, I'm stoked. The gum rubber on this too, like, oh, I'm huge on gum rubber. I got the zoom pocket. Seven hours later. Yeah, it's hard to get this out. Yeah, it's got the zoom pocket. It's just super clean, man. Like, when, when you see them online and everything, they look like it's a different material, but this is all, this is like the, I'd say it's very similar. To the orange lobster material so no hype i'd only i've missed out on the gray ones by about five ten minutes but what they were saying was it was like a nine and eleven so is what it is we're still on the hunt for the elevens when we're in melbourne hopefully we can find them i'm planning on going into a bowl that's the skate store where you've got to do a trick in three tries to get it so i ain't skated Like three years, but the other one we got, the Culture Kings, this blew my mind because I didn't hit on any raffles. I know people have missed out on them. And they were just sitting on shelf at Culture Kings. Yeah, man, these, these are fire. I'm huge on green. I know people say, you know, Celtics and Jordan's history with the Celtics. Oh, wow, what the fuck is that? No, oh, it's pulled straight off. It's like a red, I don't know, like clay mark or something on them. But let's have a look at the other one. Make sure there's no issues. Just good clean fun right here. The Lucky Greens. I think because they got the white hits on them more so than the pine greens. I really like these, but yeah, these are fire. No, I, I really, I really didn't, I didn't go in too many raffles with these. My whole thing was like, look, I'll go in the ones where you pick up in store. If I don't get them, it is what it is. But if I see them out and about, I'll grab them. Seeing them in hand now, I'm, I'm so stoked that I did. So let's get some B-roll, wrap this up. Expensive day, especially when you consider I'm meant to be saving money for my Melbourne trip, but... <laughs> I couldn't help myself, man, like... I didn't hit on any of the raffles for the Lucky Greens. I was like, if I see them around, I'm gonna grab them. I was hoping for the grey orange labels, but the black ones I was looking forward to. I didn't expect to see them because they restocked and then were gone. It was more the grey ones that had recently restocked. I only just missed out on them. I was probably a day late, but look, we got two out of three. We're going to Melbourne this week. I will be going to the Evolve store, seeing if I can still do a heel flip and get it done, man. So look, lots of content coming. The last Melbourne trip, we got so many videos out of. I've got nothing planned bar the kickstand event. Shout outs to Jay from the kickstand. We'll definitely be doing a lot of content over there. But this has been another episode of Crease T. Make sure you like, share, subscribe. We'll be back next week. We're not doing another one this week. Another one episode for this week because it's too crazy, man. I'll be on the road driving and shit. I won't be able to edit nothing. Till I get back. So, little hiatus, but a lot of dope content to come out of it. Peace.